So Michael Avenatti desperately wants to run for president and in the last three weeks has destroyed his own party's credibility on Brett Kavanaugh, lost a lawsuit against President Trump. Now he jumps into the Stormy Daniels Donald Trump fight with a video so good that I want to make it my permanent ringtone. Here is Michael Avenatti sounding off. For those who can't see, Michael Avenatti, you know, this is this is really high style. He has taken his phone, turned it into selfie mode, and now he is filming himself speaking very seriously into camera about horse face. Here we go. It's a sad day in America when the president of the United States calls a woman a horse face. Donald Trump should be ashamed of himself. I don't care if you're on the right, the left, or the center. No man should call a woman a horse face, especially the president of the United States. I have two daughters. I think it's a disgrace. I don't care what your political persuasion is. You should condemn it as well. It's oh, wrong. It, it's so wrong. It's the wrongest thing. He paid his client off. Trump paid his client off $130,000 to shut up about nailing her 10 years before while he was running for president. But the real problem is he called her a horse face. No one in this country should be called a horse face. Under Amendment 87 of the Constitution, it should be illegal for anyone to be called a horse face in America. I'm sorry, we need to play the beginning of that again because the way he says horse face, like you can see his internal monologue going, Michael Avenatti. His internal monologue is, don't laugh, Michael. Don't laugh when you say horse face. Don't laugh. Damn it, this is like his fifth take. This is his fifth take. His first four takes, he had him breaking up. Play, I, have, I, I, I enjoy this too much. When the president of the United States calls a woman a horse face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've laughed more in the last week and a half thanks to this news cycle than I think a horse the previous face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and Democrats love this idiot. Oh, it's the best. It's the best. Who thought that was a great idea? He's like, you know what? I'm going to jump into this campaign because I'm going to flip this camera around. The president should never call anyone a horse face. That's like the ninth worst thing Trump did yesterday. Like Trump said that Brett Kavanaugh was equivalent to the Saudi government who just killed a man, dismembered him and liquefied him. And Michael Avenatti is deeply, deeply concerned about the horse face comments. Woman, a horse face. Had <laughs> <laughs> no president should call. I promise you, by the way, that Bill Clinton called women far worse than a horse face. Like way worse than a horse face. LBJ was not famous for his for his gentility around women. Really? 